All right, how we doing? Uh, thank you for watching Insta Clinic. Uh, my name is Lamont Johnson. I'm the wide receivers coach at St. Ambrose University. And today I'll be talking to you about how we run our bubble script. Um, there are numerous ways that we can go about running this bubble route, but here at St. Ambrose, we kind of combined it, the, the most traditional ones. Um, traditionally, or the most common, just a simple, you know, line up, balls inside. We're gonna back drop. We're gonna turn our back, and expect the ball over the shoulder. Um, we, we tried that numerous years uh, didn't really work out for us that much um, we had a low completion rate and it was kind of a, a tough target for our quarterback to hit uh, so we switched it up and we went to the back pedal technique getting the balls inside and we just back pedal back ball snap we just back pedal back um, we had a higher completion rate with that technique but we kind of had a hard time getting out getting getting that depth because we're trying to get that bubble outside of the sideline so we kind of had a hard time doing that. So now, um, about four years ago, we kind of combined the two. We combined the traditional just drop back, turn, and then we're backpedaling, okay? So the whole time we're, we're, we're running, we're looking and we're trying to see how these blocks are gonna get lined up. Whether it's, I got one guy out there blocking or I have two guys out there blocking. My eyes are on my blocks, seeing where okay, I'm gonna so go. While I'm looking downfield, checking out the blocks, and I see that my receiver is taking, taking my, deep, my defender all the way out to the outside. I'm gonna stick my foot in the dirt. I'm gonna take it right up the middle. All right, then if I see you got, you got the outside um, strong, then we're gonna just take it right around that outside block. Okay, um, our goal is to get five yards every carry. Every, every bubble screen, any screen we, we throw out, we're getting five or more yards. We believe that our guy's better than the guy we're going against, so we're gonna go ahead, get that five plus yards, try to move those chains. Um, then again, like I mentioned earlier, our goal is to get that ball outside up the sideline. So here down at the bottom, we have the bubble. Um, so notice, notice the bubble man's eyes. As you can see right here, his eyes is right here looking at the block. Okay, there's my defender. Now where's my block gonna make, gonna take me? Okay, so we choose to take that ball up the sideline and outside, which is good. The ball carrier's job is to make the, blo make the blocker right. Here's another clip. Bubbles coming down at the bottom. Again, turn the shoulders, back pedal, put the foot in the dirt. Again, notice his eyes. His eyes is looking at the defender trying to figure out which ways he's gonna go. Catches the ball, you see the receiver has him pinned, has the, has the inside protected, leaves him one-on-one -on -one with this guy. So he chooses, takes it up, takes it inside, tries to get back outside, which is good, because we're trying to take that up the sideline. Good job by him. Here's a tight view of it. Again, we're trying to get that ball outside outside those numbers and up the sideline. Then here's the last clip out of trips formation. Again. Comes out. Shows his back. Checks out the block. How's it set up? Okay. Turns back pedal. And we're getting up that sideline. Moving the chains. And again, our goal, our goal is to get five or more yards every time. And we're moving the chains each time. Again, thank you for, for watching Insta Clinic. Thank you for checking us out. Um, if you have any questions with anything with St. Ambrose, feel free to contact us anytime you need. Thanks.